friction, why hockey rinks are not carpeted. If you've ever slid a hockey puck across an ice rink, you know that it can travel a long way with just one push. In fact, if you don't touch it, the puck might go so far that it doesn't stop until it hits something like a wall. If you try the same thing on carpet, you find out that there's a reason nobody plays hockey on carpet. The puck doesn't go very far on a single push. If you hit it with a hockey stick and then don't touch it, the puck slides across the carpet a bit, slows down, and then stops. What happened? Since the velocity of the puck changed, there must have been a force acting on it. That force is friction, the force that slows objects down as they move across surfaces. Why does friction cause objects to slow down? Friction is a force that acts in the opposite direction of an object's movement. Surfaces that are rough or sticky tend to have a lot of friction when an object moves across them. Surfaces that are smooth tend not to have a lot of friction. That's why the hockey puck moves much further with one push across the ice than across a carpeted floor. Carpet is rougher than ice. There's one place where there's no friction at all to slow things down. Space. On Earth, there's some friction caused by air in the atmosphere. This friction is known as air resistance. However, in space, there's no air. Therefore, there's no air resistance and an object that starts moving will keep going forever unless a force is exerted upon it, such as when it collides with something.